Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum to my all students. I hope that you all are good and fine. Very good. And enjoying your e-learning classes? Very good. I was expecting this. You are my good students. Yes, so let's begin. Are you ready? So raise your hand for dua. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Rabbi zidni ilma O Allah increase my knowledge Amin summa amin So I am going to teach you English class 4 So what we are going to learn today Today we are learning about spider web and mind map don't confuse it's very simple first we learn about a spider web as you have seen that how a spider web is spider web kaisa hota hai? yes so it is something like this but how we can use it in our english so let's have a look spider web is used basically before writing a composition so the composition when you going to when you will write the composition it will easy for you to make the sentences so don't worry i am going to tell you spider web spider web for making a spider web there are two main steps throw the ideas on the paper when you have a topic to write the composition you uh, you will get a lot of ideas in your mind about related to that topic so when you get all the topics in your mind just throw it on the paper means that write it on your paper in the next step it must include w's plus house questions means the words that you are thinking about uh, the topic it must contain some ideas like you can answer some W's question and some how questions. What are W's question? Don't you know? Okay, so don't worry. I am telling you. W's questions are which begins with the word W and the words who, where, when, what, why. Is it clear? It is also mentioned in your word book so you can take help from it as well. And how questions are which begins with the word how, like how many, how much, how word, etc. Is it clear? Shall we move on? Very good. So, I hope that there are some confusions uh, that how we can make the spider web. So, let's clear it by an example. I have selected a topic, my best teacher. So, how to start the spider web now let's think about some words or some ideas in your mind i hope that you have a lot of words in your minds right so <clears throat> the next step is to answer some questions which starts from w or which are how questions like who is my favorite teacher now when you are talking about your best teacher so you have to talk about you have to talk or you have to write about the teacher which you like the most so who is my favorite teacher where does my teacher live when does she come to school why do I like her how would I describe her what does she teach me right these are the basic questions related to our topic my best teacher right now coming towards the spider web how can we put it keep i uh, put the answer of these questions in a spider web here it is so you can see that i have i have written here around the topic name my answers so my web is completed now clear okay so there is an other topic 
just like it but there is a little difference in it that is mind map what is mind map do you know the difference in mind map and spider web is that mind map is the next step after making the spider web and what is the purpose of making mind map the purpose of making mind map is to delete the ideas you don't want to include in your essay there there are main steps for making mind map as well number 1 is delete the ideas that you that no need to include like if you think that your idea is some like uh, you don't want to add in your essay so you can delete it the next next step is number of paragraphs now think about the number of paragraphs that what which part you will write first which part you will write in the last which part you will write in the middle okay now, la now last one is jot down the ideas it means that make a rough draft and jot down the ideas like in the sequence that how you will make the sentences and which sentence will come first which sentence will come after is it clear good now look at this this example that the spider web which we have, which we have made like i delete two words from my spider web number 1 is funny as you can see on your right corner right corner and i have deleted well dressed on my left side clear so in this way i can write my essay more appropriate and more beautiful beautiful and as i followed the step so it is now very easy for me to write about my teacher my best teacher clear now what is your task your task is to make a spider web then mind map and then rough draft of the topic my country this is your task you have to do it and the teacher will ask you when teacher will ask you to send your work you will send it to your teacher for checking so i hope that you will do it inshallah you are my bright